Hey guys, XQ here back with another video. Today is October 5th, 2016. I'm currently three days out and it's time to get aesthetic. Hello, how are you guys all doing? So yes, it is October 5th, 2016, three days out, uh, 6, 22 p.m. here at the Commonwealth. Been training here for the last four years. This is the last day I'm training before my competition. You guys will see I'm very drained, meaning I have no carbs whatsoever. Like I said, the only carbs I've been eating are vegetables and those are digestive carbs, pretty much meaning your muscles are not gonna really take them. It's just gonna be used to digest that other food, which is the meats that you're eating or any other little things out there like the rice cakes and whatnot. Uh, that being said, at the end of this video, stay tuned because there will be a flexing comparing when I carb load and when I don't carb up because during this day, I was depleting literally starting the morning all the way from whenever I started dieting and now I'm slowly starting to carb load. Uh, I starting this Wednesday, which is today, and Thursday, Friday, and then Saturday morning is my carb loading. Obviously, I'm starting it off really light, so you won't see a big, big difference. But these past couple days, um, been completely carb depleting, doing full body every single day. Um, my last day, which is this day, I did 30 minutes of cardio to finish it off. 15 minutes on the bike, 15 minutes on the treadmill to constant pace, high incline cardio. Uh, so when I do full body, it's pretty much hitting every single muscle group, chest, triceps, biceps, shoulders, traps, back, abs, legs, everything, every single day. And I did that for Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Um, I believe Saturday I did shoulders and Sunday I did uh, rest because I knew I was going to be doing full body Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday to really deplete the muscle and deplete all the glycogen stores. Uh, that being said, uh, this is pretty much, you know, the last last bit. I mean, all I'm doing right now is after this, you know, just the food. The food is what matters now. And uh, what I'm going to be experimenting on is the cheesecake little thing that spikes up your insulin and what that pretty much is stating that I'll be having a little bit of cheesecake just before I go on stage not right before but roughly about a couple hours I'll have it maybe one or two hours max I'm gonna have it the Friday night and then uh, an hour to two hours before the competition itself uh, when I come up to um, close to the competition I'm pretty much carving up on uh, rice cakes uh, sweet potatoes is my main carb up right now because it's high in potassium so I don't cramp up on stage. I might have a banana or two. Um, just before I go on stage I'll have, uh, there's a certain kind of cookie that I always have that tends to really like help me out, gets, gets the blood flowing. Um, it's the, I'm going to have two of those, two chocolate chip cookies. It's a specific kind. Um, and I'm also going to have dark chocolate which I don't know why but I noticed to get very vascular. Uh, when I tend to eat that so that's pretty much what it is gonna be and what I'm gonna be eating and, and stuff like that obviously I'm gonna have to pump up certain certain ways like for instance hitting the chest and back first because those are bigger muscle groups then finish off with the arms and stuff like that so we'll have to see what's going on but anyways I'm super excited for this show guys there's lots coming three more days guys three more days hope you guys enjoyed this last bit of the video just a little bit of progress, showing you guys the difference between carb loading and carb depleting.